Hey, Chris from the Mighty Decibel here. Welcome back. It's that time of year where you're inundated with top 10 lists and we're going to join in the fray uh, by naming our top 10 hardcore punk albums of 2023. And in our lexicon, hardcore punk includes grind, D-beat, um, hardcore, uh, metal punk, anything of that nature. So let's stop fooling around and get into it. Coming in at number 10 is our fave Pure Grind album of the year. It's World of Doom by Germany's Corpse Eater. So this one comes at you fast and furious over a compact 23 minutes, over 18 tracks. The short blast not leaving the listener with much room to breathe or think for that matter. Start up the chainsaw. Self-proclaimed Cincy Mutant Punk outfit, the Doomers come in at number nine with their demo 2023 six tracker. So it's our fave metal punk release of the year. Uh, the Doomers come across like an unhinged cross between the Dayglow abortions and the Crumb Suckers. Landing at number eight is Croatian four piece Plastika with their self titled 14 minute EP. High energy all around on this one, ratcheted higher by some excellent female bullhorn in your ear vocals. I'm not sure what the hell they're talking about, but they're pissed about something. Budapest Fastcore Outfit Crippled Fox come in at number seven with their That's Just Life Now. Uh, so this veteran band uh, mix crossover thrash with their bass fastcore sound uh, to create a face melting sound that'll paste you to the wall. Fast, furious, and fun. <laughs> Let's go! 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 Let's go!
at number six is Sand and Gravel by Boston's Intensive Care Unit. So if you're a fan of crumb suckers, you've got to check this out because the, the parallels to their Life of Dreams opus from 1986 is clear. Same catchy, uh, quick paced action and sandpaper vocals. The pits are going to move for this one. Number five album was a late entry this year, actually being released in early December, but made an immediate impact here at the Mighty Decibel. It's Harsh Reality by Chicago, Illinois noisemaker Stress Positions. So unrelenting is the order of the day here, immediately going for the jugular and sustaining the close to chaotic attack with nary a break between songs. <laughs> no break whatsoever. Pissed and loving it. down to the top four hardcore punk releases of 2023 and this is the cream of the crop uh, if you don't have time to check out all 10 make sure you check out these four amazing stuff and uh, coming in at number four is our fave db record of the year it's uh tistvar with their self-titled release it's a little bit of a cheat in that um this is an upgrade in production from their demo of 2021 which landed very high on our list that year uh but regardless if whether you've heard it or not uh previously in demo form this is most definitely worth checking out if db runs through your veins angular riffage runs rampant here while the great vocals spew out the facts d beat heaven self-described grind and roll crossover outfit emissaries of sin take the number three slot on our list with their full length entitled the core assumptions of human insecurity so this grinds up a storm with some crossover references uh, the, the uk outfit lay waste ears over the allotted 30 minutes here what really stands out though is how catchy this is uh, unbelievable uh, pretty difficult to do for this type of fare excellent stuff No. 
Rounding at number two is Sonic Rites of Rock and Roll by Dog Attack. So what we have here is some face-melting rock and roll played on 10, likely assisted by some excessive alcohol intake. Uh, so it's exciting and execution, truly hair-raising in its electric power. Uh, this simply kicks ass despite its relatively short nine minutes. Consider it the updated version of the Stooges' raw power record. So now we're down to the number one hardcore punk release of 2023. And while slots four through two are really interchangeable, our number one is not. In fact, the first time we heard this, uh, we suspected it would be number one and it held its position throughout the year. It's Six Songs EP by Japanese extremist MV11, short for Maximum Volume 11. So if there ever was uh, a record that defined the concept of Blitzkrieg, this would be it. Energy levels off the charts. MV11, grab your throat from first note to harrowing last call. Uh, it might only be 11 minutes, but after you listen to this, you're likely going to have to dry off. Uh, raw, hardcore punk at its best. there you have it six songs ep by mv11 our number one hardcore punk release of 2023 and what a great year for hardcore punk man uh, every month there was uh, seemingly four or five high quality releases uh, to listen to so it was pretty hard to come up with our top 10 lots of other stuff out there that you can check out and uh talking about checking out Remember to check in with us next week where we move into Hard and Heavy Week, uh, culminating with us to, uh, defining what our top 10 Hard and Heavy uh, albums of 2023 are. You know where to go, www.themightydecibel.com. Have a great one, eh?